Hi cozy friends, how are we? I have more updates on my room and my setup, which is great, I'm so excited. I went to Target today and so now I have a haul. Now I have a haul to share with you all because I have no impulse control. Um, but I thought I would do like a mini house tour that's like my unfinished home right now. Just to just give you a little sneak peek on the rest of my house. Here's unfinished living room situation because, oh, hi Chila. Oh, hi, what's up? What's up, babies? He just ate, so he's probably a little sprightly right now. This couch is Maya's, my roommate and best friend, uh, dad's old couch that he gave to us just so that we can have a couch because we didn't have a couch and we don't have money for a couch yet, ayo. But um, this is the unfinished living room. Uh, we will get a credenza and we will get a couch and then it will be generally finished. We need to hang things on the walls as well. We have it, we just need to hang it. And here's this little uh, section over here. We've got little artwork over here. This thing. And then our bookshelves and game shelves. And of course, Chila needs to be the center of attention. Chila, he knows, he knows. Yeah, you know, you know. Okay. And then here's my kitchen. It's, there's dirty stuff. This is a realistic house tour. Don't look. Here's this little thing we have. Yep, just a little thing in our entryway. And then here is, ignore the mess. Ignore the bags in the back. You don't see that. And the stuff on the chair. Here's our living room. Still need to hang things on the walls. And here also, a little fall wreath. And then we have this guy. These little pumpkin candles. Hi, Chila. We have these guys I got from Home Goods. I got this from Trader Joe's. This is the uh, honey crisp apple scent. And this little wax warmer, it's got like apple cider scent in it. Okay, but here's my haul. I'm so excited. I got this pumpkin and this pumpkin to put, I think, either outside or like right here. How cute. It lights up. Isn't that so cute? So I think it's like a cute little pumpkin section. And then I got a wreath hanger because Target has this cute wreath. I didn't get it today because I got too many other things. But I have a Christmas wreath and I want to get a fall wreath to put on our door. And then this, actually to add to this so that there's a little more varied color in here. So let me do that now. Pretty. Now it's kind of, uh, you know, a little bit more dynamic. And then these are the coolest thing because I think I've said this before, but I usually don't like how fake plants look, but these don't look like fake plants. It looks like a real one and they're hanging and I want hanging plants so bad. So I got two of them because they're only like $14.99. Yeah. Look how freaking cute. I think I'm going to put them near my desk somewhere. Speaking of shelves. I got a long one of the same kind and then a short one for that spot above my TV. And I'm gonna put the long one on the bottom and the short one on top. Again, dynamic. And maybe I'll put those plants on either side of the short one. Of course, I have to get these guys for fall. Okay, I just ran upstairs. Um, I'm gonna show you all the finished prints that I hung up. I'd already gotten them and hung them up when I was editing the last vlog, but I like too many things were happening so I didn't include a clip. So here's the update. Here's how they look. I think they look great together. Here's my new wall lamp that I got with Gantry. I did a little collaboration with them and it's forest green. It looks kind of black sometimes, but it's forest green, which I thought would match well with my little plant over there. That's that updated situation. I think I'm gonna leave this be for now except finding something to go in there. I also did more updates here. I put this cloth on the background to cover up the white things. I hung this little guy up. I think he's really cute. And then I got this from Target. I got this pumpkin from Target. I got these handles from Goods. I got this from Target. And then I put this sconce up that I got from Hay. So I'll put a link to that. And I got this candle from Michaels. So I have that right in the middle of my little shelves. And then I got these because Online, it looked like the cord was also gold, and I really wanted little gold ones, but they aren't, so I got some new ones that I'm gonna hang up. I also have these little green guys in the corners, 
but I don't really like them, so I think I'm gonna take them down. And my rug came in. My rug came in. I haven't laid it down yet, though. I'm gonna go finish unpacking all my groceries, and then I'm gonna do the lights, and that'll probably be it for tonight, and then I'll do more updates later this week. Bye! All right, y'all, I just changed the lights. And I like these a lot better. I like them a lot better. I'm gonna get some batteries and see what they look like. All right, there we go. Much, much better. I really like it. I think I'm gonna ignore that, please. Um, I think I'm gonna put the rug down, even though that's a mess and it's gonna look like a mess for a while. Um, Cause I, I tried doing cable management and it fell down, so. I'm gonna try another method where there's like a clamp box thing. And then I might try hanging these up tonight. I might do it, I might do it. If I do, you'll see it. Okay, bye. start putting up things over here, but I'm really happy with it. Hi y'all, hello. So I have updates. I have my shelving update, which is behind me and I'm really excited about it. And then I have um, uh, something cool that just came in the mail, which will basically like finish this portion of the wall until I decide that I wanna do something else, which I probably will. Here they are. And then I have this top shelf, which has my little BMO, and some little stuffies that I have. This is tonkatsu, and this is the shrimp guy that's always with tonkatsu, and that's the bowl from Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town. That's the carrying case for this guy, which I don't know why I have it up there. I think I just like the color of it, but maybe I'll like put something in it. I don't know. I'll probably end up taking it down and like putting something else up there, but I just like that there for now. It's a nice color. And I have my two keyboards. I have my Pixel Chick. I don't know if you remember Pixel Chicks, but they're super nostalgic for me and I really like them, so I bought one off of eBay or Mercari or something. And then here's my little Gudetama figurines and my Gudetama Tamagotchi and then I have a Tamagotchi right there. And another Jinkatsu. So this is like my nerd shelf, you know? You come in, you know, you walk in and you see like pretty decor and I'm gonna have, you know, my, my dresser and my mirror and pretty decor up there. And then you go, bam, oh, she's a nerd, oh. Oh, oh, I get it, I get why, why she has, you know, this huge monitor with uh, whatever <laughs> she has. That's that, that's why I kind of put that over there. Also because, you know, when I'm laying down and when I'm sitting at my desk, that's kind of the one I can see the most. So I like to see the things that I love to see. And then this is more decor and when I'm sitting kind of close to it, I can't really see it. So it's more for, for decor's sake. That was my thought process. My next update, this is the area that looked blank to me and I just wanted a little something, just a little something. So it came in the mail and I'm gonna show you. All right, also this is the broken cask. It was sent to me it's by Shoreless Skies, a publishing company. Here, I'll give you a nice background for it. It's a solitaire innkeeping game, which I've never played like a tabletop game like this where you're like rolling dice and stuff. It kind of reminds me of like D&D or something, but solitaire, which is awesome because, you know, I like doing things by myself. Uh, so yeah, definitely try that. I haven't, I'm trying it out this week before I post about it and stuff, but try it out, y'all, if, if it sounds interesting to you. This is what I got for the space. I'm so excited. They're from Urban Outfitters. And one, they're like little tile hangings. One's a mushroom and one's a little flower with a smiley face. Isn't that so cute? It like matches perfectly with the colors of everything. Yeah, I'm gonna put those right over there. The prints that I bought, I bought the prints, so they're coming in the mail. I will up update you on that after. The next project in my room 
the things I have to like save up for or find on Facebook Marketplace, which is the dresser here, and then I have to do a little decor on top in the mirror there, and then a rug. Yeah, so those are my updates. Thank you for coming along with me while I just blab about my space and my plans for it. I'll show you quickly after I put these up. And then, yeah, that's all I got for you right now. Bye. Okay, here they are. Aren't they so cute? I love it. I feel like it fills that space perfectly. Still pretty minimal, but cute. Matches the theme. All right, cool. Hi y'all, um, I, I, I went shopping again. When do I not go shopping? When do I not go shopping and get too much? I got too much and, and, and y'all like hauls so I'm gonna share it with you, okay? I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna share, I'm gonna share, all right. I decided, ignore all the crap over there, but I decided that I wanna like decorate this in front of my TV because it's kind of blah. So I got a little blanket shawl which is in the $5 section at Target. She was waiting for his food. I think I'm gonna like lay it across that area so that it's not just like the slab. I got a desktop microphone because the only microphone I have is this really fancy one that like does noise canceling and you can really only hear out of it when you're like right up against it. But I don't have one for like if I have me and Maya or something like two people playing a game and needing to record it. So I got this like kind of cheap one, but it's desktop so it should, should pick up everything. And also I was thinking for work so that I don't have to have streaming microphone for work. <laughs> and then I got a little pumpkin again for that area. I got a set of pumpkins for, I think I would sprinkle them around the house just for light sprinkling, you know? Do you like the smell of these or something? What are you smelling? Do you just wanna bite this? Then I got candles for that area. This is another candle for that area. She wants to smell everything. Do you like it? Do you like the smell? No? Okay. Then I got this, which I've had my eye on these because they're cream and they match, but I only have these ugly ones I got from Amazon and I've wanted to replace them for so long. So these are perfect. They're only $30. Then I got this lamp, $5 section. Again, for there. We'll see, because it might block it, so maybe I'll put it somewhere else, but. So because I got these and I don't like them, I'm gonna replace them with these. I think that's cuter. Look how freaking cute that is. Look at that. So I don't know where I'm gonna hang this. I was thinking maybe replacing that and putting it there, or maybe I can put it over here. This is kind of empty. Let me know what you think, if I should put it. I don't think I'll hang it up until I, I crowdsource an idea. Maybe, okay, so I'm moving that mirror over there. Maybe I can put it there. Let me know, y'all. And I got this to go under the TV. And it lights up, look. Bing. I think that's everything. I got a bunch of fall foods, but I don't think y'all wanna see that, so bye. Here's my final product for the area. It's it's fall. It's not very practical because those things are blocking the TV, but it's fun, it's fall. There we go. There's some some good old Gilmore girls, some fun fall stuff on the bottom. Hi y'all, I just want to do a little bit of journaling with sapling stickers today. They were kind enough to send me some of their stickers a while ago and I've been obsessed with them ever since they reached out to me and I wanted to share them with you all. They have really cute gaming themed stickers and just other really cute stickers. So definitely check out their Instagram or their website and let's get into the journaling. Okay, so this is my typical layout that I do for my to-do for the next day. Here's some of the varieties that they have. So they have like Stardew stickers. You can see I've used a lot of them. They have like artisan goods. They have Animal Crossing ones. And then they have these cute fall ones, which I think I'm gonna use.
All right, and there is my journal entry for today. I really just keep it simple because I used to get pretty uh, perfectionist-y about things and it would I would just like never actually do my to-dos like this. So I think just like keeping it simple and having really cute stickers that do all of the work of making a page look cute. I think it makes it easier to crank out your journals but also make them look cute and make like checking off to-do lists fun because it looks cute. <laughs> All right, and here's the frames with the prints that came in. This is the last shot I'm taking of this area. The fresh fruit friends and the sturdy flower dance. It's so cute. So I'll link those below. Whew, okay, lots of changes, lots of new things. Thank y'all so much for watching and just having a little, a little cozy revamping of my room. Again, I'll continue to do more vlogs about my room because there's just always room for improvement, you know? And I, I'm definitely not done with my desk area, so I can't wait to show you kind of the finished product of everything and once I can get my rug and my dresser and yada, yada, yada. It's a long process, but I'm starting my job next week, so then I'll actually have a source of income <laughs> to be able to get these things so I'm really excited for that and I will see you next time I love you stay cozy bye